The 2013 Golden Globes saw no shortage of eyebrow-raising jokes, surprise winners, and hilarious moments, and we have your 2013 Golden Globe show highlights. Funny ladies Tina Fey and Amy Poehler hosted the 70th annual Golden Globe Awards live from the Beverly Hilton in Los Angeles. The duo kicked off the show with an opening monologue that made us proud. Perhaps the most shocking celebrity diss they dished out was for Zero Dark Thirty director Catherine Bigelow by Amy, who delivered quote, when it comes to torture, I trust the lady who was married to James Cameron for three years. It was as if Amy's words set the tone for the night. Later, we saw Tina pose as a seat filler for some of the nominees during the show, dressed in ridiculous costumes. First, we saw her hilarious version of Julianne Moore wearing fake teeth, then posing as Damien Francisco, complete with a wig, mustache, and glasses. As for winners, it was HBO that dominated the TV wins. Homeland was a big winner, including the award for Best TV Series Drama, Girls won Best TV Series Comedy or Musical, and Game Change won Best Miniseries or TV Movie. This year's Globes was not complete without some high-profile presenters, and possibly the most surprising award presenter was former President Bill Clinton. He introduced the video package for the nominated film Lincoln, and following Amy Poehler joked, that was Hillary Clinton's husband, to the audience's delight. Her cohort, Tina, snuck in a Taylor Swift joke whom wasn't spared any embarrassment. Taylor Swift, stay away from Michael J. Fox's son, she said, this year's Mr. Golden Globe. And what would an award show be without the acceptance speeches? Jodie Foster gave a serious and hilarious speech for her Cecil B. DeMille Achievement Award, revealing she is 50 years old, she's tired of acting, her mom is sick, she's single, and hates reality TV, saying, I'm not Honey Boo Boo Child. The big motion picture winners came at the end of the show with Les Miserables winning Best Comedy or Musical and Argo winning Best Drama. One of the most surprising wins of the night was Best Director going to Ben Affleck again for Argo beating out Quentin Tarantino and Steven Spielberg. What was your favorite moment from this year's Golden Globes? Give us a comment and we'll be sure to respond. I'm Erin White in Hollywood. Thank you so much for watching Clever News.